some Christmas decorations in Primark. Christmas in October. And the cheeseburger. We have candles. Candles are the best ever. Look at those. Tinsel. I'm so excited for Vlogmas. I thought this was gonna dance, but it's just a doorstop. Oh, unicorns, they're so cute. I like the and candy I, yeah, cane. I like the candy cane too. Like and these, these are cute. These are so cute. I think I'm gonna be buying some Christmas decorations in October. Look at what I just found in this store. We've literally gone from Christmas to Halloween in 0.2 seconds. So cute. Listen, they like these. They're so cute, I really like them. Just got my first pumpkin spice latte of the season and it's so good. I'm obsessed with them. We just found more Halloween stuff. Oh, there you are. That's what we had before. Something like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Didn't we? Oh, there's stencils in there. Show me back. That one's a bit rubbish. No. Well, I like the cat one. Which is good as well. Who is that? Oh, that one. And the bats. I like that one. We love Halloween in this family. I think we should. It's a llama, I think. It's a llama. As soon as we find Halloween stuff, we find more Christmas stuff. Two hours later. It's been a while since you saw the last clips of me and my mum in town. I've been home for quite a while now and I've edited that footage and just spent time with my family. But I picked up some really nice bits from Primark. I think I'm gonna show you everything that I got cause I got some really cute pieces, especially for Halloween. So the first thing I got from Primark are these cute little devil ears with roses. I can't wait to wear these. I also picked up this one which is a witch's hat with a veil and this looks super cute my mum likes this one then from tiger i picked up this stencil book you can just stick it to the pumpkin and carve around it and then there's one in here that looks like a cat and obviously that was my favorite because i love cats i mean on sunday from church when i said it was harvest sunday they were giving out these little candy apples i have yet to eat it so i think i'm gonna attempt to eat that and I think I'm just gonna chill, watch Charlie Brown and the Great Pumpkin, do a face mask maybe. Now I'm sure if you're doing this for Halloween, chances are you have an Annabelle costume. I do not have an Annabelle costume. So I'm then going to create the shadow of her dress using gray eyeshadows. If you guys haven't watched Made You Look by Lex, the YouTube channel, she is so talented i've been watching her probably for like three years now i find special effects makeup so interesting i've actually dabbled in special effects makeup myself insert photos and videos here hey guys so today i'm going to be showing you how to do this special effects burn Also, don't forget those purple and neutral shadows. This took me around half an hour to do when using a hairdryer. This is special effects makeup. And a fact about me is that you may not even know that I like special effects makeup, but the thing is I do. But yeah, I am so like amazed by special effects makeup, especially at Halloween. Like these videos I could watch for hours because it's just so amazing. Look at that, that looks real. You know, she, oh, she's so clever. This is the Annabelle video she just uploaded. A few moments later. Okay, guys, I think I'm gonna scream because I think there might be a dead spider in my apple. What is that? Like. I'm trying to stay calm. This shot looks like a Shane Dawson video. Hey, what's up you guys? Yes. My parents say that this is the core of the apple, but I don't believe them. I think that's a spider and I'm not eating it. That does not look safe. So I'm gonna run a poll. Do you think it's a spider or do you think it's the core of the apple? That looks pretty insecty to me. I feel disgusted, I feel hurt, I feel grossed out, I feel like that dead spider had babies and now <laughs> I don't believe it was just a stalk. Mm. I need to floss my teeth. <laughs> 